Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a brand new series of modded Minecraft. Um, I may have to manually install Toast Control. Uh, this is a pack by the name of Mass Production, if you can't read that, because their pictures seem a little bit large. Um, it's a 1.12.2 quest pack, and it's literally about massive production. Hi there, Cadet. You've been chosen for your vast technical knowledge and engineering aptitude to participate in the mass production program. We, the Galactic Space Council, have, at considerable cost, transported your body to the distant planet of, well, we are not exactly sure. What we do know is we are going to need a lot of resources in order to build a ship capable of returning to pick us up and bring us there if you are still alive. Consider this a habitability test. If you manage to complete the task presented, then we know that wherever you are is habitable and quite frankly better than our current home that has run out of almost everything. So get to it, is cadet. I think it's supposed to be uh, space cadet, or just not have that there. Uh, go find us some carbon-based find some carbon-based life for us and scan it with your quest book. Once you do this, we'll upload data on several different technologies for you to use and get started collecting everything we will need for the return. Completing this quest will grant access to the following technology. Bonsai trees, snad, quark, quark item pipes. Please note, playing party, all players must claim the end reward for each stage. To end, to this end, the quests are repeatable in case someone is late to the party. Awesome. Uh, we need some wood. Uh, oh, and this is updates. Okay. We don't need to do that. Um, I did just update the... Can I? Yeah, thank you. Um, let me seem oddly zoomed in here. Hang on. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Video settings. Can we... Okay. Uh, we'll go 50% brightness. I thought we had a... View width thingy. But I guess we do not... No, view width thingy. Good job. Um, we also have some very loud sounds. Let's see the master volume 50. Blocks 15. Friendly creatures can be down here. Turn all that off. Ah, one more thing. Controls, auto jump, buzz off. Right. Uh, that's too much the other way. I'm going to be forever hitting that. I think we can do maps. Right. Uh, trees! Let's go find some trees. This one looks like a likely tree. Now we appear to have forestry, which is good. I know some people can't stand it anymore, but, uh, well. I like, um... Yeah, toast control is going to have to go in this pack. But I think, but I guess we can tolerate it for the length of the episode. Uh, we did start... Oh. Options, controls... Open, close inventory is tab... Done. 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 There we go. Uh, we did get a suit of Faraday gear, which is the armor from Immersive Engineering, which is cool. Uh, wrong quest, thank you. We need this one. Detect submit and claim our console command reward, and voila. So we now go to night. <coughs> okay. Uh, we will need fuel, vast amounts of fuel. Gather the requested amount and submit it to us. We have automatically compacted and we will have it automatically compacted and prepare it to use it to use to power power our rocket production facilities. Yeah. They weren't... Okay, 640 cactus. Green is the official color of the Galactic Empire. If the planet you are on does not have some form of green pigment, it is a deal breaker. <coughs> we just could not live on a world without green. So find something, anything that is green and refine it for us. We'll use that to paint everything. <coughs> yes. No, this one will be easy. Ah. Uh, go away. The Galactic Council requires a solid foundation to build on. Find something... 
Something hard enough to support our large infrastructure. Find some hard m mineral and collect enough to cover 20 platforms that are 9 meters square for the base of our rocket facilities. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, it's probably going to be a very long trip if we're going to need fuel, not just for travel, but for our bodies as well. Find some... Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. Find some form of glucose on that planet and collect it for us to process into sweet little cubes. 640 sugar canes, which is not as bad as it might seem. And melons, which is really easy. Tucked away in your back pocket was a small envelope of melon seeds. These are an absolute requirement for us to consider a planet habitable. If we cannot grow our melons on that planet, we will not be able to press the sticky juice from that f the flesh and bathe our bodies. That would be horrific. Collect a large amount of melons for us, and we will prepare the bathhouse for our arrival. <laughs> oh. So we have to do these five quests in order to unlock um, the next one. All right. Okay, that was annoying. Right, so we are on some planes. And what mods are in this pack anyway? Um, it's not that. Okay. Brilliant. Come here. There. Are you happy? Go away now. Uh, yes, I will go get toast control and so we have buildcraft, which is nice to see. Well, of course we have chisel. I will go through and item hide some a bunch of this stuff because yeah, forestry naturally, immersive engineering, of course. Uh, nuclear craft is here. I think nuclear craft is what did in my uh, my modular mayhem series. Uh, quark, sonar core. Ah, sonar core means we have calculator. Yeah, I'm. I know for a fact uh, there's 84 supposed to be 84 mods in the pack, so I'm pretty sure that some of the stuff has not unlocked yet. I do like having the buttons up here. Um, we are using FT. That's FTB utilities. Um, I don't like their chunk loading, but. Also, the map has decided to break itself for some reason. Go away. But that's just JEI. Oh, hello. Uh, so, I kind of want this quest. Yep, there we go. Sticky dipping. <laughs> uh, that's a that's for getting literally a, a quest for getting stuck in oil. So, you know. Uh, uh, B? Ah, here we go. Build craft oil, which we will probably be getting into, because this is a, this is a pack about mass production, which means we're going to need rather a lot of material, and quarries are a great way to do that. Uh, we have some sort of critter over here. Um, they ah piggies. We have piggies. Many many piggies. Um. I need to find a place to set up that I can. Okay, the health bar thing is kind of could be annoying. I might have to work out how to configure which mod is doing that and turn it off. Now we're supposed to have structures generating. Oops. Okay. Can you just go? Can I still? Yeah. I can still get to it with tilde, so I don't need to. Uh. Ah. <coughs> I do like that it gives me this instead of forcing me to make one, because it's a pain to make. So. Oh, hello. Is this what I. It's a very shallow ravine. Alright. That's. You know what? That's use usable. I'm pr was hoping for a bigger one because I like li I do kind of like living in ravines. They make a good place to set up initial. You can set up an initial base without. 
having a bunch of resources. Hello, Colt. Hello, Iron. Hello, Iron, my old friend. Um, auto jump off. Right. I see copper there. Uh, yeah, this is a actually a pretty good. This is a pretty good mining ravine at least. Uh you know what? We will mining cave. There we go. We'll bookmark that and we'll come back to it. You know what? As long as we're at this, let's go ahead and Convert all that. One of those. That's really all, all I need right now. Because I'm going to get some. Going to get some stone. Put a little bit of stone there. Okay. Minecraft. Auto jump needs to be off. I don't want freaking auto jump. Stop it. <clears throat> right. Where was I? I was getting stone. Uh, let's. We can go ahead and go this way. Yeah. Oh, there's a ton of iron here. Right. So, mass production. Uh, apparently, the ores generation has been tweaked rather <coughs> extremely in order to facilitate the ease of getting a bunch of resources, which I like. Um, do we have 11? We have more than 11. Alright. Let's get some coal here. Because coal is a thing that we are definitely going to need. Um, they want 640 coal. Um, I'm going to need rather a lot of coal myself, so they can just wait a bit. Um, I'm fairly certain I can build the build craft quarry already if I had the resources to do it. I just don't, so we'll have to wait. Uh, let's see. Tell you what, let me grab my. Put it there. It is. Crafting table. <coughs> We're gonna make a door. We're going to make a wooden axe and a pickaxe. Right, you come down there. You come there. Right. You go there. What we're gonna do is lock ourselves into this little hole here. Put a door. And then we will take the rest of our cobblestone and block ourselves in. There we go. Uh, <coughs> that's a pumpkin pie. That is not for mining. At least, if your pumpkin pie is for mining, you might have a technical problem. A <laughs> uh, couple of sticks to get more. You go there. Uh, you need to be on three, thank you. There we go. So, uh, because it's nighttime, and, you know, stuff's going to happen outside. Hi, excuse me. I'm going to be not outside. Uh, ooh, hello, Cole. I will happily take that. And I will gingerly um, extend my base here, or um, my, I say base, uh, my temporary little hovel. hovel. Uh, there we are, and we'll just work our way through the resource through the various resources. Um, I am kind of wanting to use up this iron, this stone pickaxe. Uh, wooden pickaxe. 
So the last pack I played of this flavor was Automaton. It was focused all around um, immersive engineering and mechanism and AE2 eventually. And I really like that pack. And I'm hoping that this is very much similar to it, although this one is a more massive scale of pack, really. Uh, which is the thing I like. I, I went to the effort of finding a quest pack that filled the what is it I want to do from a quest pack, which is which is this. I mean, last pack I saw of this, of this particular nature, or this particular scale, rather, was... Material Energy 4? 3 or 4. The one Dire Wolf and Pahamar played. And where he, where they had Torturinos producing massive amounts of uh, sugar cane. And taking it, in t taking it over to be sucked up by Annihilation Planes from Applied Energistics. And it was just uh, hilariously good fun, even if it was only a one per would have been a nightmare for just one person, I think. Especially because of the extreme difficulty that they were facing. And so... <coughs> excuse me. I kind of like that style of pack. I mean, it's less of a... Okay, this pack is just super hard because reasons kind of thing. Like, um, I... I intend at some point to play um oh what's the name of the silly pack infinity expert mode I, I still intend to play that pack but it's a case of if I'm going to play that <coughs> excuse me if I'm going to play that pack I'm going to need a reason to do so uh, let's have a torch here and we can torch here so that we don't die horribly. Um, but yeah, if I'm uh, gonna play that pack, I gotta have a reason to want or need to play that pack. And right now, I have neither. I have no one to play with, which, you know, I, I have internet that is really quite awful. But it, it, it's the sort of pack I would be willing to go to the effort of playing even though, you know, my internet sometimes just decides, oh, here, have all the lag in the world. Uh, gravel we probably won't need, but, you know, I'm certain there's reasons to have gravel. I think you can, uh, what can we use you for? Concrete, uh, okay, we make concrete powder. We can make coarse dirt, which can be useful for decorative purposes. Uh, okay. Yeah. Unfamiliar items. Uh, basically, so stage 4 is where AE's unlocked. That uh, we can make it in the sand. We can use the mixer to make liquid concrete, which is kind of a cool thing. Uh, yeah, it doesn't really have a lot of uses. But, you know. What about flint? Flint. We can make a stone pickaxe out of flint. Oh, that's a core thing. Okay. I'm not. Uh, last listed recipe using. Excuse me. Last listed recipe using buttons. Ah, okay. So it's. So it is. Yeah. We. So we couldn't technically build the build the quarry yet. Alright, that's fine. That's actually t entirely fair, really. Um, guys, can you just not... Alright, so what I'm going to do... Uh, I'm not a, not a huge fan of cave starter bases, but... You know, uh, I would have... Theoretically, I'd need to venture outside and grab some iron to make some proper swords. Uh, there is no tinkers as far as I know. I, I mean, 
this pack is not really designed for tinkers. Sword? Yeah, there doesn't appear... Um, yeah, our best weapon is vanilla diamond swords or immersive engineering steel swords. Uh, now, I'm kind of hoping something else unlocks later. Okay, yeah, so some so things will unlock later. We just don't have... If they're not unlocked, they are, don't appear in JEI. Right. Fair enough. We need our other another door here. And then this one can be axed down. Chopped down, I guess. There we go. So we got a little more open space here. Uh, actually, if you're not grass, you can't... Excuse me. If you're not grass, you can be shoveled. Yes. And one of the great things the cork does, one of, <coughs> one of the few reasons I do like cork, is that once day f day comes, baby zombies will burn. I did not necessarily... You know what? I, actually, it's fine. What I'm going to do is fix up our little hobble here. Uh, we won't live here. I'll build a factory. Because, you know, factories are cool. There we go. We'll build. I th I'm pretty sure that's a cork change, and I agree with that change. Uh, do I want... No. Oh, excuse me. Not like that. Thank you. There we go. Hey, here we go. Okay, everything is... <laughs> right, I hear you there. Ow! Thank you. Please kindly die. Okay, Zomble. Come get some axe. There we go. I had a question to ask him, and he answered. Alright, so first things first, let's get some weaponry online. So you want 1600 cobblestone. Well, you know what? Cobblestone is the sort of thing that you just can't avoid having. Um, yeah, these iron veins are massive. Um, I'm definitely going to want them to try and get to a stage two with the quarry. Uh, although, to be to be entirely fair, I wonder if we have thermal expansion in this pack. I don't know if we if we do that would be great because they're the thermal hammers are amazing. Uh, we might not because and uh, that would be okay. Uh, if if we don't, then I'm gonna want an immersive engineering drill. Because the immersive engineering drill is awesome. Uh, more tin. I, I, I might want some bronze too, but we'll we'll see. Coal is the sort of thing that we're gonna need a lot of. Uh, I'm gonna have to investigate the key bindings here and see if we have or any of the ore excavators because that would be fantastic I mean I love the way this is being this has been done by the way these huge nodes of material it means that I'm not going to run shy on resources and it's been a problem in some packs where okay I don't want to use tinkers and my pickaxe just my pickaxe breaks like that, and then I don't have the resources to build a new one because so I end up be it ends up being very difficult to make any progress. Well, let's go ahead and just make two. There we go. 
because we're just we're gonna need them, frankly. Uh, right. Okay, then we'll do one, two, th three. Yeah. Uh, you can't shift click these in here because these use these are used to make. Um, excuse me, you. These get smelted into. Oh, maybe they don't. Oh, maybe I can shift click into it. Uh, that's fine. Uh, grab that. Grab that. And now we can have, voila, one iron pickaxe. We got that, and now we have an iron sword. So now we can stab some, or rather slash some uh, critters. The thing I am going to want next is, well, we need to go find... Oh, hang on. I see cows, which is fine. Uh, but this is peonies. I thought it was flax. Not that... You know what? Not that it matters. Because we have immersive engineering. And I just need to find enough... Oh, hello. Can we use these? We can indeed use these. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, in just a couple of minutes of worth of pickaxe work, we found almost a stack of iron. Oh, and apparently we managed to not pick up the tin? Okay. Oh, I don't know how I managed that, but sure. Right, so we'll come back here. We'll come back to the house. We are going to need food, and food is, you know, a thing. Grab ourselves a bucket. I can actually do. Uh, I need to do this because I need more sticks. I'm gonna need a stone hoe. I'm gonna need to chop down more trees. We need to plant balls. Hey, there we go. I do love the speed of a iron pickaxe. I mean, they aren't they aren't the fastest tool in the game, but they're pretty good nonetheless. Yes, I'm using a bucket on dirt. No, I don't care. Um, right. Uh, water? What? There's some water north. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Water. I need a bucket. Okay. I, I while investigating packs, I did see a bunch of packs that had, you know, finite water, and that's great. But uh, why am I doing it that way? Do it the hard way. If I'm not as smart as I think I am sometimes. Um. All right. You go there. Hello, Mr. Water. Two, three, four. Alright, I'm going to make this farm off camera. So, this has been Let's Play Mass Production with Trix 2. See you guys next time. Bye.